So the percussion in this song and sound effects were designed to accentuate the story of the song. So it's about greed and lusting for power, developing machines of war, mass destruction. So it was trying to sound industrial, like they were building these things, or almost like the Terminator, like these things were st stomping in on us. Also having some organic sounds and just some power to it. So let's listen to those in the chorus and see what they all sound like together. everything so let's talk about the individual elements so i was watching mad max fury road and i thought wow this movie is the soundtrack is great and there's the part when they had the chase and the guys playing the guitar and with the flame throw and the big drums the taiko drums were playing so i was like that's a cool idea and i already started putting in these taiko drums in here and uh i wanted to take this a step further and add some metallic elements to it. So let's hear the taiko drums first and then we'll add the metallic elements. So before I got into the metallic elements I thought I need some low end. So I found an 808 kick sample I had and I added from the uh, Superior Drummer Action set their kick. So that almost filled out like the whole clave rhythm of it. And I took the action tambourine, which filled out the rhythm for me, but then gave me some of the metallic element. So to round it off, here are the three other elements of the metallic percussion. So here's the metallic low. Kind of industrial. Has a pitch to it. I remember changing the pitch to work. Here's another element of it in the higher register. And here's both. So let's check out the chorus with all these elements in and then with all the elements out. So when they're out, it sounds like a good rock band with a good drummer. When they're in, it sounds like a whole emotional response, a cinematic approach to it. So let's check out in the pre-chorus what happens. Here they come. A 660 snare drum reversed. That leads into a clap. Then I felt like I wanted to have some other element accentuating the downbeat and adding a rhythmic thing to it. So I found these samples of guns and I put those in and I, I realized in the back of my mind I must have been watching the Metallica documentary where Bob Rock, who's one of my favorites, has his headfield cocking the gun in time. So then to, to sort of bring some, I don't know, discomfort and agitation to, to have a release in the chorus, I added this loop that sort of builds and fades in. Then after that loop happens, there's a big like explosion on the downbeat. So all that together sort of makes this whole thing happen. So here's the drums and percussion together in the chorus.
and without the percussion. Back in. It definitely rocks harder with it. So that's all our drums and our percussion and our sound effects. So that was The World is on Fire by Moguls of Mayhem, Anatomy of a Mix, number one. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. Hit the notification button so we can let you know when we have more. Hope you stay healthy and well. Keep making music. Thanks.